The atmosphere here is one of concern, as there is still no news of 10-year-old Sean Mars who disappeared yesterday. A recent report indicates that the police are now treating this as another kidnapping by the origami killer. If this information is confirmed, he Hello may there, still be alive art. as the previous victim was killed for you? three to five days I'd after like a room. their abduction. Obviously, for you, anything. For the investigators mm. trying to find the child. Feeling the register. I'm Michael Netty for ICN. This is such an important message. There is probably more written in medical journals about sickness than any other circulatory disease in perhaps diabetes. In its first two stages, this disease is reversible. Madison page 27 single how long will you be staying with us Ms. Page I don't know yet room 201 last floor stairs on the right in the courtyard thanks the pleasure was all mine that's for sure Room 201, stairs on the right, last floor. That obnoxious receptionist better not have a spare key to my room. The thought of it leaves me in a cold sweat. Room 201, stairs on the right, last floor. Someone there. Is he, sir? <coughs> Are you all right? <sighs> I'll call an ambulance. No ambulance. You're badly hurt. <sighs> you need a doctor. Please, just help me to my room. It's number two zero seven. really out of it. What the hell happened to him? Have you got the key? You're really in bad shape. You should see a doctor. Must have one, maybe two broken ribs. It's not fatal. <laughs> but it's sore as hell. <laughs> Your head is bleeding. It looks deep. I should disinfect his cuts. Medicine. There's bound to be a medicine cabinet in the bathroom. Paraphenol anti-fever. Administer only in cases of high fever. I should disinfect his cuts. I'm gonna disinfect your wound. This might hurt a little. There. At least it won't get infected. Thanks. He's in trouble. I can't just walk away and leave him like that. I'll help him first and ask questions later. Necofrin 100 antibiotics. Administer to combat infection.
paracamol painkiller. Administer in cases of intense pain. Do not take more than one pill every 24 hours. Here, take this. It should do you what some good. It? It's a painkiller. It'll help reduce the pain. It says on the box to take one every 24 hours. I don't think it's a good idea to exceed the dose. I can't afford to wait. I wouldn't move around for a few days if I were you. I, I'm gonna take a shower. All right, let me help you. I'll wait here until you come out. Let me know if you need anything. Talk to me. That way I'll know if you pass out. What's your name? Madison. Are you staying in the hotel? No, I live in town. I suffer from chronic insomnia. I seem to only be able to sleep in motels. Don't ask me why. Whenever I get too exhausted, I, uh, I come and spend a night here. I'm... I'm just passing through. And what else do you do, Madison? Apart from fixing up strangers. I'm a photographer. I take pictures of uh, furniture for fashionable design magazines. And you? I... I'm an architect. Thanks for staying. I feel a lot better now. Okay. I better get going then. By the way, you never told me your name. Ethan. Be careful, Ethan. Why didn't you shoot? Sorry? Well, back there, Nathaniel could have had a gun. Could have killed me. Why didn't you shoot? I prefer to have all the information before I make a decision. I try to make rational choices when possible. 
come on, you had a fraction of a second to react. You could have whacked me before you had time to move. I'm sorry. I thought you were a tough guy. A street cop who's been through the mill. I didn't think you'd scare so easily. Why don't you fuck off, Norman? That's him. <laughs>